a great project for our dear friend Marty Lawson at Temple Emmanuel in San Diego. Marty, we had met at Camp Swig, and he worked with us in our workshop for 20 years there. Every summer we went to camp together, and every summer he spent working on our workshop, helping our students, working on his own projects, and helping us with all of our Judaica, and liturgy, and inspirational needs. And this was probably in about 1985 or 6 that we created this project for Temple Emmanuel in San Diego on the theme of Jacob's Ladder. And what we've represented in this abstract composition is the wings of Shekinah. And unwritten on these wings are the whole text of Jacob's life all the text of his life, all the events of his life prior to his dream on one side, and all the events of his life following his dream on the other side. And it emphasizes what a seminal moment his dream was, how different his life became after he had his dream. At the center of this composition, there's a ladder, just like there's a ladder at the center of the story about Jacob's dream. The ladder is what connects the heavens and the earth. And this very special ladder made out of dichroic glass, this specialized type of glass that transmits and reflects light simultaneously, is surrounded by 10 forms, 10 talit type forms that represent a minion, that which is required for Jewish prayer. At the two sides of the composition, there are also a pair of ladders. They're represented as ladders of light, and their rungs also are made out of dichroic glass. And of course, there's exactly ten rungs on each ladder. And on each ladder, there are ten angels. On one side, they're going up, and the other side, they're going down. They may be angels, they may be birds. It's a matter of interpretation. The text is arranged on the wings of the Shekhinah in blocks of five lines each. And those five lines represent the five lines of musical notation. Because in Marty's synagogue, music has been and always will be at the center of their worship and their spiritual life.